graduated from the university and still reside in this village without a job. Hey, Obi, please don't talk like this now. No, why would I talk like that? Come to think of it, if I'm to be a rich dude, having all these exotic cars, big mansions everywhere, your father will not treat me like that. He will worship me for what I have. But there's no problem. I know what I'm going to do. Mm. What are you going to do? I'll just leave this village for good, go to the city and look for a greener pasture. Let me know when I make the money if you will still treat me like that. City? You want to go to the city? Yeah, hey, now, that's the only thing I uh, can do in this situation. Please, uh, before you go to the city, you just have to come to my house and pay my bride price. So I'll come to wherever you Actually, I love you too, but how can I pay your bride price with your father's attitude? Your father would never accept that diary from me. It's impossible. He will accept it though. Do you know what my father is waiting for? He's just waiting for you to come to my house and tell me that you want to marry a large. He will accept. He will accept. <laughs> That's when he will break my head. What do you want to do? Okay, Gwen, let's go to a mommy in the and buy bread and a cream for her. Thank you. Do you have money? You tell her that we will pay her to me. Yeah, yeah. What you want? I'm scared of going home because I don't know what my father will do to me. That's why I suggested I take you home. Come, let me take you home. Take you home. Eh? Don't... No, 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 no. Hey, tell my father to break your head. Hey, no, don't worry. I know how to handle it. He's my father. He will not do anything to me. Oh? I'm sure about that. Mm -hmm. Because I'm, I know why I'm talking. I don't want any dent on your skin. That's when I'm going to lose it. If he's going to do something stupid, let me accompany you home now. He is still my father and he is old. He cannot give birth to a beautiful Olachi again. <laughs> yeah, you're right, but don't say that man is old. He's just playing with people. I know what he's doing. But the truth is that I'm, I'm getting tired of all this thing. I'm telling you, see you tomorrow, leaving you behind. I just want to be with you all the time. If I wake up in the morning, you're around me. In the afternoon, in the night, you're there to give me my dinner. I mean, it gives me joy, darling. Oh, baby. Yeah, you know. I feel like going home with you. But, you know, you cannot go home with me because of my mother. You know? That's why I want to get married to you right now. To avoid all this insult of people telling us what to do. Okay, but I just pray your father will be a block. I I have told you to leave these people alone. Eh? They, they are looking for who to implicate them. But, but they want to implicate somebody. And they will implicate me. Because I'm going to kill them. If I don't kill them, they will kill me in this land. Eh, Papa, Papa, nobody is dying. Mm -mm, I disagree with you. What you have to do is to go to Mwara's house. Tell the parents that you don't want Mwara to be seeing my sister Olachi again. Your daughter. 
tell them that whatever one has sees out of this, he will take it that way. That is what you have to do. Nobody is dying. Don't make me believe that this, these ears of yours are just fancy on this head. I have told you severally that I have been to their house. I have told his parents. In my presence, his parents warned him. But this boy would not listen. He insisted on dying in my hands and wish one day I would grant him the favor. Ah! Olachi! Come out here! You are doing me. Why? Come out. Whatever we are saying here is for your own good. You are busy. You are hiding there. You are peeping us, Abi. Come here. Come here, come here. I have told you, Wara is a non entity. He doesn't have anything in his, in his head. Leave that boy alone for your own good. The earlier, the better. The earlier, the better. Who told you I'm hiding? I saw you hiding. Me. It's like you don't have respect. You. You don't have respect, Okoya. Let me tell you, in case you don't know, Wara is a graduate. Wara has full strength. He has power like a man. He's a hard working young man. Let me tell you another one. You see, Wara, he has all the qualities they want in a man. Yes! Ha! Oh, you even have the guts to come here and place a defense on that idiot? That hopeless thing? I see. Wait for me. I will let you know the difference now. It's okay, that, please. Papa, she took that way. She took which side? Take it in a Stop pleasing me. You are the cause of this whole problem. You! You! It's now. Take it easy. Eh? Please, take it easy. She don't know my daughter. Things are happening in this village. So disgusting. I saw a man and a woman making love on a main road like this. Yeah! On a broad day, man. Can you imagine that? Yes. Can you just imagine that? Making love, what? I said I will not die. You will not kill me. My son will not kill me. I will not develop hypertension because I have a son. Yes, I will not do it. No. But let me ask, am I the only person that I have had a son before? Why? What is happening? No. no. What, is it? what has a Laura done again? What has he not done? I asked what has he not done? Look at when I was coming, I met him, um, uh, okay, so, raging and running to my house with my jet, coming to set me his car with my son. If not that I met on the road, why would I don't know what would have happened in this house? But hey. don't tell me this is all about all our chief. If not, who else? Hey, what is that? I don't know what that girl has met my son and they have taken away his house. He has he, he protects him. He's not hey. behaving, he's no longer himself. Nice. What is it? Hi. Come, 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 let me let me ask this question. I don't know if I am the, the, the father of this guy. I don't know because I never see a him God that will be like him. But then, where is he? Don't. Right behind you, Papa. Just right behind you. Um, I, 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 let me ask you. Eh? Um, Mora, what has this girl already did to you that has taken away your mind that now you are no longer yourself? If I have a Oh. What has he done to you? Answer, Papa. Hey? Oh, you, you remember what that man did to you? You remember? You remember what because of Adam? Hey? I love this girl. Hey. Laura, you okay me? You okay me? Okay me? What do you know about love? They're talking oh. about sensible things and you're talking about love. Thank you, Mama. You know the way they hate you. Mama, Mama, forget about this hatred of a thing. I know what the man is doing. He's trying to scare me out for marrying his daughter. Stop my hands on this one right now! Stop! You say something like this if you're talking about you're talking about love. See? Oh, Mama, you're trying to give me pressure like this. Hey! hey. No oh, amount of yeah. pressure will make me leave that girl. Period. My son has it. They have, they have hey. it. Hey! Mama, you will not kill me! You won't kill me in this house! You can't kill me! You got the kind of name! This man is calling me because of all these things. No, 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 I don't like the way you're talking about what, what are you talking? Is he behaving like me? Papa, it's okay, Dad. Is he behaving like me? I don't know where the song is coming from. This is where it's coming from. I don't know what the song That girl was lucky I did not meet him in the house. I met his father on the way. Otherwise, This is 
in out of hand. Has it, has it gotten to a point that you go to his father's house wanting to attack him with a machete? It has gone beyond that. So long as he doesn't want to leave my daughter for me, it has gone beyond that. And I am prepared to attack him, even kill him anywhere. There is no solution we are looking for. The only solution is that this boy stays away from my daughter. Let him leave my daughter alone for me. And all she should face her future. If they don't, two heads are going to roll in the streets of this land. you're doing is not good though. Eh? Stop it now. Why are you stressing yourself over this matter? See, Papa, nobody can separate I and Moral. He even said he's, he's coming to, to pay my bride price. Olashi, what did you just say? Will you shut up your mouth? Can you keep me in there, Mozo? What did you say? I didn't hear you. Papa, you heard me. That one is coming to pay my bride price. I will pay this out Brother of yours. Oh, is, is everything all right? Oh. You look at me and you think everything is okay. Provide him before I set this house ablaze. Oh, no. Mora is not in this house. I've not even set my eyes on him since morning. Uh, don't tell lie to me. Don't. Provide him immediately. How can I tell you lies? How can I lie to you? I have not seen him. In fact, I was about to go in before you came. I swear, I have not seen him. Uh, anyway, 
that, that useless thing. That by the time he finishes riding, he should also avoid me in this village. Because any day I set my eyes on him, I will give him premature death. Do you understand? Tell him. And deliver the same message to your parents. So now some person for die be come. Mora! Hey! Hey! Oh. You startled me! Startled? What are you scared of? It's all lashes, father. Oh, like she's father nearly broke my head for my involvement with her daughter. <laughs> no, 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 it's not a laughing matter. <laughs> Moira, is all actually the only girl in this village? Huh? Why do you want to die because of this girl? There are too many, too many beautiful girls in this village. When I say beauty, very beautiful. Boobs, ass, everything that you can take from. Huh? Why all actually? Water. 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 How many times did I call you? When do you think this war with all Ashi's father will end? By the time I get married to all Ashi now, all this nonsense insults will end. What's the meaning of this nonsense? Eh? He will chase me to east, not south and west because I love the daughter. Get married to all Ashi. Are you. <laughs> I'm, I'm planning to pay all Ashi's bride price. I'm telling you now because you guys are my friends. Oh, yeah, we've heard you. We've heard you. Please, where are you people going to? Oh, I want to go at, uh, see my babe. Well, Lachi, come now. You are doing six. six. Come on, So, are you always hide here? Very soon, I'll block that road. Is not around. Why are you hiding? Mm -hmm. Always, you're always at that junction. <laughs> I'm in serious trouble. <laughs> what is it again this time? Don't know. Papa caught I am Mora. Huh? Mm. Where? When? How? You know, Papa, now he's an old man. We're not doing anything bad. But now you'll be seen as if we're doing something bad. You were doing something good. What were you doing? I'm gonna take it easy now. Oh, uh, so that I will know where to help you from in case Papa comes emergency. Okay. Uh -huh. We're trying to kiss. Hey, what? Kiss it! Oh! You were trying to do. Ah, I was. I'm trying to. Papa was looking at you face to face and you were trying to. 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 to kiss. Eh? Papa's. No wonder you won't just, just do it today. Oh, today is a special day. You, you just do it. So you go and do it quick, quick. Thank God, pa Papa caught you. You don't have respect. No! Let me know where to judge you from. Oh, Papa will soon come. Look. Oh! We're not doing it in Papa's presence. We've not even done it though. We're about doing it before he now saw. Okay, you did it in Papa's absence. <laughs> hey, what? You! Papa! You! Papa! Papa! No, Wara. No. No. Tell me you didn't mean what you just said. Nah, uh, my brother, I meant everything that I said. I'm planning to pay all Lachi's bride price. After paying it, I will move to the city with her and search for a job. Eh? No, what am I doing in this village? At least all this nonsense will stop. Ah, Chike, Nora said he's going to marry a girl. Which their parents disapproved of their relationship. How do you think they are going to give her to him in marriage when they don't even approve of common relationship? Can you have a point to 
You have a point too. Okay, what now? Tell me. What makes you think that Mazi Okezu will give Olachi's hand to you in marriage? Now tell me. Well, uh, the truth is that I don't know how it's going to happen. But I don't know. But something in me tells me that it's possible. Love, they say, conquers all bonds. I believe the love we have for each other will, will, will open up new doors. Who knows? I sincerely hope it works out fine for you guys, yo. It will work out. It will work out. But if you ask me, <laughs> I will say that you are dreaming of impossibility. Unless you are planning of eloping with the girl. Who should be a stupid thing, no? Am, am I stupid? Far from me. No, no, no. Why will I do such thing? Just watch and see. We're in this village together. Or the car. Eh? Okay. Watch and see. Don't worry. Leave everything for me. So, I just hope it works out well. Mm. I, I don't get you, Nkechi. Are you suggesting we should give our daughter's hand in marriage to that 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 non-entity, futureless and hopeless somebody? No, I never said anything like that. <laughs> Did, are you not tired of putting up a fruitless fight? Are you not? Okay. What have we not done to stop them? They are moving closer and stronger towards each other every day. Nani, what baffles me is what you said you saw them doing last night. If all like she takes in for that boy, if she gets pregnant for him, don't you know that will be an abomination? Imaro. Oh, of course that will not happen. It will never happen. But if it does happen, I will kill her. I will end her. Neno Nyenka. Okay, you will kill her. You will end her. You think killing her is the solution? Let me tell you what will happen if you kill your daughter. You will not only lose her, you will go to jail for it. Enolia, none of us bargained for this thing. Is it not better we leave them peacefully <laughs> and save our family name? Okaroma, God forbid. Eh. I will never, never give Olachi, my own daughter, to that, that nobody. Because as far as I'm concerned, he is not existing. Okay. What are you going to do? Hmm? Are you not tired of fighting in vain? Are you not? Nine. A stitch in time saves nine, if you ask me. A stitch in time saves nine. Let us leave these children alone. Let us leave them and save our family name. Waka woman drum. Now. If you leave these children to continue doing what they are doing, whatever she does, it is the same name. Wherever she goes, our name. So the best I can do is what I'm doing now. Is that name I'm protecting? Oh, yes, please, guess what? Just guess. Yes, yes. Uh, you finally decided to go to school? No. Say something else. Uh, your younger brother is traveling to abroad. Uh, no, Obim. Obim, you know what? Uh, my father has agreed. No, he has approved that you get married to me. Your own father or another person's father? My own father. <laughs> Come <laughs> down, <laughs>
running up and down. I know how you follow these people. The young man is tired. Huh. He had no option. So much. Come on, sister. <laughs> you made a suit so you had to tell me that I love you. Casting. With the way I talk of her in the morning, in the afternoon, in the night, even while I sleep in. Oh, I sleep on that. You should know everything, now. You know everything. Aura. I hope you won't come out tomorrow to break her heart. Because I will never forgive you. I will not. Sometimes you just sound so silly. Why would I do such thing to the woman I love? Am I mad? No, I will not try such thing, my dear. Don't worry about that. That's just so. go inside. Prepare something very delicious. Please <laughs> You know this calls for celebration. <laughs> it's which money now? Then Papa drop money for me. You know, I'm jobless now. Let us tell me. Hey! So now you know you are jobless and you are planning on getting married because there is no money. I didn't drop anything. What do you know about marriage? What concerns marriage? It's too sad and depressed for me. There is no food. Don't spoil my mood. There is no food. Uh, Mazo Kizia, my good friend. My son here said that I uh, saw an apple in a compound. Very beautiful one, which uh, he cannot take his eyes away from. So he decided to ask us to accompany him to your house so that he can legally block the apple. Eh. Uh, eh. Uh, eh? I, I don't understand what you're talking about. Uh, I don't grow apples here. And my compound is not a vineyard. I, I, I don't. As your case here, we are aware that you are a full-fledged Igbo man. We understand the parables and adages of Igbo land. We are aware that some differences which have been already resolved Please let us go back and face the issue we are here for. Uh, Olachi. Olachi. Papa. Come. My elders, I greet you. <laughs> Do you know these people? This man? <laughs> yes. Or he's asking your hand in marriage. Do you accept? Yes, Papa. It has what? It's a go. I know this wine will not go to back without without being drunk. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Uh, okay. Nani. Nani, why are you in such a mood? I'm in such a mood because I'm bereaved. Yes, I'm bereaved. A man that loses his only daughter has right to mourn her. Nani, what are you talking about? Our daughter is not dead. To me, all that she's dead. She's dead. God forbid. All that she is not dead. My daughter will not die. Nothing will happen to her. Something has already happened to her. It has happened to her. A girl that decided to give herself to a useless non-entity. What is the difference between life and death? It is as good as dead. Lord, she is dead. But, but, but she cost it herself. I, I, I didn't cost it. We have not lost anybody in this house. 
we are not going to lose anybody in this house in Jesus' name. What is this? Nkechi. Nkechi. If you like, it will come down. Now leave here before I destroy something now. Whether you're destroying something or you're repairing it, I will leave. But I'm telling you, we've not lost anybody in this house. Leave my presence before I lose my... What is this? What can I do? Thank you, Tacey. You really made my day. Huh? Mm -mm. No, you made my day. Thanks for being my friend. Here, I have this money. I want you to buy some clothes for yourself. You know, change your wardrobe for tomorrow's outing. You promised, right? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thank you, darling. I, I really appreciate it. It's okay. You're welcome. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Take care. Okay. What is happening? What are you talking about? I will tell you. Okay. I saw Tessie, Chief um, Omeka Agu's daughter, mm -hmm. and Wara. If you see the way they were catching fun, I mean, they were staring at each other romantically. What is happening? My sister, if I know what is happening, I will tell you. I know nothing. You don't know? I don't know. All I knew is that. Two nights ago, the guy came up with a story that he met this girl on the way, she was lost, and she was uh, she wanted to go back to her father's house, and uh, he took her back. But there was something funny he said, that there was this funny way uh, the girl was looking at him, and uh, you know, until fine boy level. Fine boy now. And I told him, my word, this direction you're going, I'm not comfortable with it. And he said that I have, I'm, 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 I'm always suspicious. Okay, what about all that shit? Is that the question? That was what I asked him. But I warned him that the direction he was taking, it was going to accumulate to something else. And, and this is it now. It's only what I'm doing. I didn't I saw them yesterday. The way two of them were awoke. It seems like they have something in common. I hate to admit this, but that guy is screwing up. No, the, the, guy, the guy is messing up. But I always play my part. And my part is to play that good friend I am. I always advise him. your friends? Uh, no, for real. Whenever he's, if he's going wrong, I'll tell him. And I've just told him. And I'll know his takes to tell him again. But please, both of you, you want to do me a favor. What is it? I don't want any gossip. No, seriously, I don't want any of you to go around telling things before it gets to all Achi. Uh, I You did not say anything. No, I did not say anything. You did not but say you anything. Advise him well, though. I'll advise him. Uh, I will not. I will not tell him anything. Look, I don't trust this girl. Is it because I, I don't like to enter a car? It's not about entering the car. It's your attitude. Just look at the way you spoke to her because, because you offered to, to, to help us. Hey. Isn't that wrong? Is that an attitude of a good woman? Please, you misunderstood me. No, you were the one that misunderstood me. Because you acted like I, I, I'm going to disappear if, if, if I enter the car with her. What, what, what kind of nonsense is that? Okay, I'm very sorry. I will not do it again, I'm sorry. Go home, I'm, I'm very angry right now. And 
It looks like we're having trust issues in this relationship. And that's uncalled for. There is no way I can go home. All right. When I know that you're still angry with me, just tell me that. Tell me that you're no more angry. I'll go. Would you please go back to your house? You've dated me for a very long time and you know the way I behave. I'm angry right now. And there's nothing you can say that will put me through. Just go home. Go home tomorrow. We'll continue from where we started. Tell me you've forgiven me, else I will not go. Okay, I've forgiven you. I can go. Thank you. My love, bye bye. It's a lie. Wait, wait, wait. You must be kidding me. You mean that girl kissed you? She kissed me, my brother. Why? Not only kissing me, she also professed her love for me. <laughs> Isn't that a good news? <laughs> that one is not possible, huh? <laughs> All right, she has taken you. <laughs> Why should I tell her that? Huh? If this girl truly loves me and ready to marry me like she claims, then why will I be thinking of the poor old lad? <laughs> Is there a need for that? It's not possible. <laughs> ha! <laughs> I always pay one. Huh? <laughs> you must be joking. Ha! How can you leave all that? Well-educated. Cool. Eh? Yeah. Are you the one saying all these things now? Yeah, yeah. You're the one, you, you, you. Yes. With this mouth. Eh? After eating all our cheese food. Eating what? That poison. Hey! Laura! Bueno. It's all actually we're talking about, too. Of course, I know we are talking about all actually. Are we talking of one Aboki in Jalingo? If God has decided to pick my call finally by sending Tessie in my life, then all actually can go to hell. All past is past tense if you don't know. Well educated, first class. Wait, 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 wait. Una, they talk like they don't use juju. Catch both of you. See, I'm not going to be a party to anything that is going to break Olachi's heart. If you cannot be part of it, then you get out. You get lost. I know your plan. I know what this guy is planning. He wants to go behind my back and take Tessie from me. I know all those your plan. You're a very wicked and a jealous person. But it won't work. If you try it, I'll break you. Even what I can do now. <laughs> you know what more I can do. Oh, what do Foolish man. Uh, uh, don't break all at his heart. Don't do this one. Guy, forget that. Thing. I know your plan. I know you very well. That's the same money we are talking of. Everybody is seeking for money everywhere. Mm -hmm. eh? Don't mind. Odika, are you going to pretend that you did not hear when this guy called me his enemy and a jealous friend? Uh, he didn't go out. He's been sitting there. He heard me clearly. Of course, that's who you are. Guy, you are an enemy of progress. Hear it now! That's what you are. Forget all these kind of people, I know them. Hey! Hola! Okay. Hola, you look beautiful these days. Well, I don't need to ask you what the secret is. I know it's because of your forthcoming traditional marriage. So, how's it going? I hope it's going fine. The preparation. Hola, you don't seem happy to me. Yes, okay. Yes, I am not happy. Seriously. For long now, I've not set my eyes on Mora. I don't know what I did to him. I don't even know if he's avoiding me. But okay, if there is anything I did to him, 
Jean, he is supposed to come and tell me now. At least I will know that yes, this is what I did to him. Then I will apologize. Of course. But this one, he did not tell me anything. He's avoiding me. I've not seen him. I'm just scared. Okay, please. If there's anything that is going on that I don't know, please just let me know. Tell me. Let me understand. I have to be honest. I know nothing. And I must confess that I'm so shocked to hear this right now. If I knew anything, I, 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 I wouldn't delay in telling you. I know nothing. But why don't you go to the house and find out what's going on? Do you know how many times I've gone there? Each time I go to his place, they will tell me he's not around. They will tell me he's not around. Eh? Okay, tell me. Does one want me to kill myself? Does he want me to kill myself for him? What did I do? Ola, I think it is on yourself, okay? Okay, you said you know nothing. Ola, I know nothing. Believe me, you know me. If I knew things, I, 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 I will tell you. There's no problem. Try and see if I can get to his place today. Please do that. Okay. Do that. Thank you. All right. Dress like this, where are you going to? I'm going out to see someone have an appointment. <laughs> Just tell me you're going to see your Lachi. Love one. Chai, love one. Chidima, uh, Chidima, how are you? Oh, Ma, sister, how are you doing? Hey. What about Obin? Is he inside? <laughs> yeah, Obi. He went out with his two friends, um, Chica and Odika. Um, there's no problem. Tell me my king, eh? Mm -hmm. no problem. Just that I just wanted us to discuss something. King, oh? Okay. But hope not for you. I will tell him we can. I'll be on my way. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank <laughs> <Goodbye. laughs> you. Oh, bye bye. Oh. coming from your place now where are you going to <laughs> i just went to check on my love but he said he went out with his friends who told you that his sister why do you ask it is because i saw chike and odika a few minutes ago and they were not with mora they actually asked me to tell him he should find them at their usual joint in case i run into him are you sure Ola, are you people having issues no we're not having any problems just that we've not seen for some days now. Then there's something he and the sister are not telling you. She's old. Oh, Kagonka, she's old. Forget her. What is this? Eh? Leave my husband alone. Leave him alone. Oh, Bongidi. Oh, Jolo Jolo. Oh, leave him alone. Mora, I won't have this village thing in South. Look at her. What is she saying? Village. Do this last thing. Look at her stupid face. Hey, I've seen you. It's yours. What is it? Will you just hold yourself and be reasonable for once? Get this into your greasy hair. What we had is history. It is over. What is the name? You heard me loud and clear. I am no longer interested in this relationship or marriage or whatever you chose to call it. Get yourself another man. I have gotten mine. 
Please don't talk like that. Now. Please, I beg you. I'm sorry. Don't talk to the bad and this should be the last time you will embarrass me in front of my, my, my fiance. Mama, please don't do this. Go and leave me alone. I'll, I'll slap you. I'll slap you. Mama, slap me. Slap my back. To this house some hours ago and I saw Orachi crying when I asked her what the problem was she told me that you disgraced her before that rich girl and told her that you are no longer interested in her is that true yes Papa why oh Papa do we have to go through this again we have to go I told you my heart does not accept her anymore this is the woman my heart beats for and she's the one I want to spend the rest of my life with. Can't you understand it? Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, let me ask you this question. What happened to the marriage introduction we did in her father's house? And the dowries we paid? Oh, Papa, they can, they can keep the change as, as compensation for whatever inconveniences this must have cost them. Yes. Mora, listen and listen very well. You see this thing you are going about trying to do. I will never be part of it. I will never be part of it. And again, whatever comes out of it must be on your head. God in heaven will bear me witness that I warned you. And whatever good that will come out from this thing that I'm pursuing, you will not benefit from it. Yes. God is bearing me witness. Yes. I don't... yes. Let it be yours. Now I demand for an explanation. Who was that girl? Uh, the girl is, is, is my girlfriend. What she addressed you as her husband? No, you don't have to mind her. She's just <laughs> saying it for saying sake. You know these village girls the way they intend to misunderstand me to her face. That's all. I don't have anything. I don't even have any feelings for her. You don't lie to me. Hey, come on, honey. I can lie to you. I mean it. You're the one I love. You know, she's just being jealous because I stopped seeing her and I'm now seeing you know ladies now. Mora, if we are to have something lasting, you must pledge your heart to me. You must promise me I'll be the only girl you will see. And you must make a lot of sacrifices for me as well. I love you the only one that I will see. The only one that I will see. Alright? I love you. You 
don't have to bother about those village girls and what they say, right? Are you sure? Are you sure? You called me. Yes, there is uh, this thing now. Mama, Papa, you won't have now. What did you hear? Oh, Lachi caught Umora cheating on her with late chief for Mekako's daughter. That one that just arrived the village not quite long. Hmm? What are you talking about? Yeah. How do you mean? Mora cheating on her, Lachi. Papa, I failed to tell you what Umora has been telling me. Mora has been saying that late chief for Mekako's daughter. And has been avoiding to see Olachi. Hmm. And today, Olachi caught up with two of them. What? So such thing has been going on in my house with her, and you failed to tell me. But why would this boy? Eh? Why would he do such thing to such a lovely girl, Olachi? I don't know, Papa. I don't know. Better mind. If I may ask. So we have to wait for Nora to come back and explain things by himself. We don't have to judge him. If it is true, I will not forgive that boy. Then why should he hurt an innocent girl like that? What kind of heart is this? You mean this is happening now? That's it. I know you should be crying, but what am I going to do? I'm going to kill himself. Wait, are you happy? You are happy, Abby? No, I just... I just don't understand you. I'm surprised. I can't believe that you, Nora, is doing this thing now to Olachi, and you're happy with it. The same Olachi that you could not sleep if you did not talk to. The same Olachi that you promised to do everything for. The same Olachi that you could die for. Now you want to leave her because uh, this just came from nowhere with this, with this, with this dirty money to front in your face. I'm beginning to feel that your love for her was never genuine. Chike, everyone knows that I have genuine love for Lachi. But the present condition of this country is way too bigger than settling with someone just because of love. Things are bad, my brother. I mean, Mali, Lachi, and go over and be suffering. It's not done. We will be born now. We got to be born. Let me see. Please, you have to understand the fact that this is the latest. You have to embrace it. Laura, eh? you're here, baby. I sincerely believe that you are on the right track. You spot him now. You spot him. Uh -huh. Maybe today, get money to the junk food. It's true. That's all you want. Look at his tummy. It's true. He's eating. Uh -huh. See, eh? if you like, support him. What I'm saying is, me, I am not in support of anything that is going to hurt Olachi. Now, what do you expect? Eh? You're entitled to your own opinion. Listen, Chike, the girl we are talking about now, her father is the richest man in this village. It's not the whole Nigeria, because that man has talked to the very uh, Kaduna, as I heard. It's not in the whole Nigeria. But her father is dead and left all his wealth for the girl. We shall be the one to be continuing. Eh? And I'll make you my PA. I beg you me stop all these things. The girl in question now is the love with our guy. I will party party Mora. Please. I'm not even promising him marriage. Just look at Mora. Look at him. Look at how fresh he is. You can understand something now, Chiki. Understand? Look at the sneakers you've been putting on for five years. Since I know you these sneakers, every time you smell up and down, is that how you're going to live your life? Uh, am I complaining? You're not complaining, but we're complaining. Hey, you don't have to complain for me, oh. See, let me tell you. So both of you now are hoping on this girl's father's money to survive. Yes. Hey! Hey! You okay? See, let me say this thing now. That girl, something inside of me is telling me that that girl, that there's something, something wrong with that girl. Nora, just be careful, oh. Shine your eyes, oh. I'm beginning to suspect you. I think you're becoming jealous. Because of the latest positivity that is coming in my life, you're becoming jealous. We need to avoid this man. Seriously. Seriously. 
Look at the good news that I've brought to the table. You're meant to rejoice with me and you're here talking rubbish. Huh? See, you, are you not a man? Can't you go and walk, make money and take care of one chick? I've searched for work now, I do not see. I would like him myself. Eh, because nothing there your head. Nothing there your head. Mwara, do you want me to believe that you will admit before my very presence that what your sister said is true? Papa, you wouldn't like me lying to you, would you? Don't be stupid. What a boldness is this? Nay, please calm down. Calm down. Allow him to explain things. Explain what? What else will he say? You heard him. He bluntly admitted it. Um, but Umara, why would you do such a thing to Olachi? I don't expect you to ask me that question. Because I've explained everything to you, sister. It makes no sense. Because Olachi don't deserve any of this. And you know it. Obi, please. I need an explanation for what happened today. What did I do to you? Please tell me. I want to know. I owe you no explanation. <laughs> what you get when you decide to follow a he goat? Hoping to transform it into a scent. This is also what you get when a child decides to disobey his or her parents. Believing that you have grown, that you cannot take decisions on your own. But an elder sits down to see you will climb to the, to the mountain, even to the top of an Iroko tree. You will never see it. I looked at this young man, looked into his eyes, I discovered that. He is an epitome of failure and disappointment. <laughs> I did warn, but you people will not hear. Brother, you say that I am an old man, I am not current. Nanny, stop. What you are saying doesn't help matters. You shut up your mouth, this woman. After all, you are the cause of all this problem. You mislead this, this, this girl. How did I mislead her? Did I not stand against her involvement with that boy from the onset? Did I not? Then, you are shouting, then, did you not give her out for marriage to him? Yes, I did. To save this family from shame and ridicule. That was why I did that. You have the guts to shout. Which shame, which ridicule? It's more than this at the end result. <laughs> Get home to your family and to say that to your father and your grandfather. <laughs> and you, you, you. Stop that. Shut up your mouth before I hit you with my bad hand. Thank you for this day. Don't mention, you made my day. <laughs> Hope you keep to your promise tomorrow. Of course, darling. Definitely I will. Huh? I'll miss you. I'll miss you too, darling. You're such a diva. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mama. Hi to my sweet looking mother. Good evening, Ma. Hmm. Good evening, my daughter. How are you? I'm alright, Ma. And you? How are you doing? I'm fine. And whose daughter is it? This? <laughs> Mama, she's late she for Mekago's daughter. Mm -hmm. She's speaking grammar. <laughs> of course, Mama. What do you expect? Huh. She's a high class chick, born and bred in the city. Mm -hmm. Actually, Mama. Out of our busy schedule, Tessie said she's going to come pay us a courtesy visit. Mm -mm. So uh, she brought this few change. She said uh, 
you can use this and prepare some special delicacies that will suit that kind of person, you know. Mm -hmm. Yes, Mama. Hey. Ah, ah. My daughter, thank you very much. <laughs> I didn't expect this. That's fine, Ma. Yeah. Babe, I'll be leaving now, okay? Okay, now. I'll see you tomorrow, right? Oh, okay, darling. Thank you. Take care of yourself. Yeah. My son, you mean all this money is only but food? <laughs> Mama, you've not seen anything yet. Tessie has promised to change my life for good if I should propose to her. Hmm? Then what are you waiting for? Propose her! <laughs> yes! <laughs> ah. Mama, Mama, were you not the one coding at me for dishing all that? Hmm. Eh? I never knew. Mm -hmm. What was happening? Now that I know, <laughs> please propose to her. Baba, hmm? Tessie is stupendously rich. Mm -hmm. Her Tessie. father willed huge amount of money to her account. If I should mm -hmm. marry this girl, our life will change for good. Hmm. Hey, my son. Mama, mama. Then who is all Archie? and her family that will stop you from clinging to this golden opportunity. Exactly. Uh, go for her. This is a long time life opportunity that we can't afford to miss. Mama, now you're understanding uh, me. You're now seeing what I'm seeing. Mm -hmm. Mama, mm? all I want you to do for me mm. is to help me convince Baba. Uh -huh. Get sense into him. Make him understand that this is for the betterment of the family, not for me alone. In that case, you don't have any problem. Don't you know who your mother is? Of course, I know. Uh, uh, <laughs> I will convince him, I will talk to him, not the time that I will call him in order. Don't worry about that. <laughs> My sweet mother. Yes, now. Sweet, sweet mother. Mm. Mother, mother, oh, mother. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> okay, mama, no problem. Have you seen what you've cost? What did I do? Have you seen what you cost to an evil child? Why did you try to fight her? Mm -hmm. Why didn't I fight her? Oh, I should just fold my hands and watch her take my husband away from me. Who is your husband? You. All I should listen. What we had in the past is gone. We are no longer together. Stop yeah, right. disturbing the poor girl. What, what, what is the problem? No, it's not possible. Oh, because of that old woman, that old thing, that's why you're telling me that what we had is not true. If you try this next time, I will give you the slap of your life. Don't tell me. This is the last one I'm giving to you. It's not true. What? No, you will not dare. See, it's not history. It's not history. Mama, I don't know why Mora is doing this to me. I have not done anything to him. All I have done is to love Mora. I have never cheated on Mora for even a day. I don't know why he's treating me like this, oh mama. I don't know why. I understand what you're saying. I understand you perfectly well. Um, Nani, I, I think you should meet this Mora. Please, tell you that what he's doing to her daughter is not good. Look at the kind of pain that he's inflicting on her. He's not good. Kiko, the such statements remain on your lips. And may the gods forbid that I do so. Never! She inflicted the pain on herself, so let her suffer it. I will only tell you three things that mean the same. One, he who fetches and infested firewood invites the lizard for a feast. Two, a stubborn grasshopper ends up in a hammer town fire. And finally, a stubborn fly follows the corpse to the grave. Continue your discussion. What have you come here to do? I'm asking you. Okay. Your brother left my sister under the rain and started chasing that useless girl that calls herself Tessie. Isn't it? And I know you are behind this. You are even supporting him. But let me leave something to you. Whatever you and your brother will do to my sister today, double fold shall be your portion. Uncle, please. I'm not part of this. Neither my mother nor my father is. Mora made this decision on his own. 
And that is what I came to clarify. If your parents are not in support of this, what are they doing to stop it? Or are they just folding their hands just like that? Mama, there is nothing we've not done to stop him. Boy, he seems to have made up his mind. So, Mora choose to abandon me like this after everything we've shared. There's no problem. Yes, so. Thank you for your good story. Are you still here? Leave at us! So, she suggested we leave this village for now, for the city. You know, and I really, really love the idea. She promised that we are, we are going to return to pay her diary. By then, this whole heat would have been over. Heat? What is? Don't actually sag, of course. Have you forgotten? Do you know the amount of pressure that is coming from my family and that of all Ashi? One day, if we don't leave this village now, these people are bent on killing us. And that would have suited you well. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, my dear friend. We are leaving the village for good. Well, I am so, so happy for you. <laughs> I can't say anything to be happy about anyway. Of course, because you're blind. Isn't it palpable that you're a blind man? Those that have eyes are already celebrating with me. My man. Your man now. <laughs> if this thing scales, you will celebrate. You will drink plenty of wine. <laughs> You're the only one I wish to tell. What we are planning now is to go to the city, travel to the city, chill out for a while till this whole storm calms down. Then we can now come back to the village and pay her diary. <laughs> That's nice, my son. Very nice. You don't have to worry yourself about your dad and your sister. They will be the one to appreciate you. When they see the benefits, it's there. They will be the one to appreciate you. So you don't have to worry. But the only thing you have to do, just give your love and care for her. Of course, Mama. <laughs> you don't have to worry about Is it because of Volage? No, 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 Mama. I can't hurt Tessie like that. Mm -hmm. And the good thing is that mm -hmm. I've grown to love Tessie even more than Volage, Mama. You should. Because that's your own heart. You follow your heart. And as it is, it's not that Olaji, that idiot forsaken one who has nothing to offer you to your marriage. Exactly, Mama. Mama, Mama. Mm. Mama, you are the only one that understands me very well. <laughs> Mama, dead. You know you're my son. Of course you know you are my son. Don't you see how he looks alike? Of course, Mama. I look like you. Who else? I don't if not my mother, who else? Resemble me now. Are you not seeing it? Look at the way you are. Did you resemble your dad? You resemble your father. <laughs> That's good. Hola. Uh. Hola. Hey, hey, hey. Mama, I'm so well. No. Are you aware that Mora has finally left this town without giving That's not possible. I saw Mora just yesterday. Okay. I saw them with my own eyes a couple of minutes ago. I am certain about it. I, I also overheard his friend saying it. Are you sure about what you're saying? I am certain about it. You're very sure? Honestly. Let me go and find out. Let me go. There's no need lying to her. Mama, please, tell me it's not true. Tell me Wara did not follow that girl to the city. Olachi, I'm so sorry. I did everything possible to... I just couldn't. I don't know why. Wara followed that girl to the city. I am so sorry. 
what has killed me? Why? Why? Oh my God. If anyone should tell me that, Mora would deceive me like this. If anyone should Stop tell me lying. that, Mora would break my heart like this. Amara, I will not believe you. Amara, look at me. Look at what Mora has done to me. Mora just broke my heart. After all the love he promised me. What have you come here to do? Have you come to laugh at me? Please get out of this place. Ola, you're still crying. Huh? Why would I laugh at you? Come on. Chiki, are you saying you wasn't part of it? Ah, Amara, how can you say that? Ola, you know we have come a long way. See, Ola is a very good and a decent girl. But she does not deserve what she got. I was against Mora, but he never listened to me. Please stop crying, okay? So it's because I don't have money. Because I don't have money. That was why Mora had the guts to do this to me. Leave me alone. Mora, there is no problem, oh. There is no problem. It's only God that will judge us. You see, in this very case, I will win you. My God will judge us. It's okay. Look. Ola, I know that God in his infinite mercy will wipe your tears for you. How can you be crying for that useless boy? That boy does not deserve you at all. Come on. He has moved on with his life and I want you to do the same. Ola, have you seen what I've been telling you? Please stop crying. Wipe your tears and go on. I need to cry this cry. Okay. I know. <laughs> Nine. Olachi has been like this for days now. I fear for her. She can't continue like this. She needs help. Please. Help on what? She got what she deserves. I stop sounding like this now. <laughs> Is it her fault that she fell in love with the wrong man? Is it her fault? Yes, it is her fault. It is her stupidity, her stubbornness. Didn't I warn you people? Didn't I? Yes, I did. So, let her go ahead and mourn herself. For once, say something nice now. Stop sounding like I that. I shut up, woman. And let me have my peace. Keep quiet, woman. That's all you can say. Keep the one can be far. Woman, so much. <laughs> Look into my eyes, you see. 
Mm -hmm. I'm looking into your eyes while you sleep. <laughs> but baby, you know, the truth is that I don't like staying in this village for anything. But having you in my life makes it more, more fulfilled for me. It makes it look like a paradise for me. <laughs> Can't you see that? This is like a poison. <laughs> Makes the village looks like a paradise. Yes. Makes my life so complete. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love this woman. The way the smile puts me off, you know. Makes me want to spend eternity with you. Yes. My oh. <laughs> it's okay, okay. Oh, look at that smile. Look at this fine thing. <laughs> Let me say one more. No, don't say no. that. I, I don't know. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's Nothing. She's fine. My sister is not in a good mood. Is what nothing is wrong? I said she's fine. She just needs to rest. I'll let you. Believe me when I said I'm sorry for what my brother did to you. You don't deserve it. You're such a good girl. And I'm sure heaven is keeping record. And he shall wipe your tears away. Be strong, oh. Be strong and move on. Please. Eh, hey, water. You are advising my sister in my presence. Mora, your brother did this to her. And you had, you had the guts to advise my sister. Now, let me, listen to me. I will deal with Mora. I will deal with Mora in this community. After dealing with Mora, I will deal with you too. Go, go, please. I don't want you to fight him. Oh, just leave him. I've handed over everything to God. Let God judge I and Mora. It is only God that will judge us. Just let him be. I will, I will deal with your brother. Who are you telling by? Your brother will see, your brother will see something. I will deal with him in this village. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. You sure? Yes. 
I want to drop you off, okay? Where are you going? I'm going to my house. I want to drop you off. Don't worry, I'm just close. No, please, I insist. Thank please. You. No, no, please. Thank you. You'll be safe, okay? Don't be scared, okay? But I said, this morning I must come and see my man. What hey! you, say, oh, you know what? You will take us to our normal joint. <laughs> Buy us, Nkwabi. Nkwongwo. You see who? Mbada. Nchi. Chicken. Halele. I got one more over the last. What did they have? What did they have? I'm going to go to the guy. I'm I'm interested in that girl. Who? Oh, the one I told you about. Mm. Olachi. Yes, Olachi. Ah, ah. Ah, what's wrong? I mean, why do you ask? Are you. What's, <laughs> it? what's there? <laughs> you know, to be sincere with you, I am searching for a woman I want to marry, but there's something special about that girl. And I think I like her. I would like to know her more. Well, Olachi is a very good girl, though. She's a very, very decent girl. In mm -hmm. fact, in fact, she's the most decent girl we have in this entire village. So how, how do I meet her? Do you want me to take you to her place? Will you do that for me? Ah, you're my brother. Come on, let's go then. You can go, eh? Let's go, let's go right away. What are we waiting for? <laughs> hey, Olachi. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. Welcome, sir. Um, where is your Olachi? Uh, Olachi is not at home. I'm the only one at home. Hope there's no problem. It's not a place like this. Not at home. See her. Come. My brother wants to see her. Excuse me. I got this gift. Tell her I'll return to see her. Yeah. My name is Kenai. Okay, my name is Ugona. Ugona. Nice to meet you. My pleasure. For us. You know, Mora brought all these things. Yes, my dear. Yes. He even bought things for you. Yeah. Uh, the, the young man that brought this thing just left about a few minutes ago. He even gave me his phone to call him. And he told me that he's going to take us abroad. Can't you see the reason of the wise decision that he made to marry the, the biggest rich woman? I am so happy. Well, Mama, there is nothing you are going to do to convince me that Umora, my brother, is right over what he did to Olachi. 
Mama, it's not right. You and I know that what he did is not right. Stop! You're a big fool! You're a big fool! Get off of my face! It's not good, though. It's not good. Me, I'm not me. eating any of this food. You're a big fool! You're a big fool! Get off of my face! Is that why your father just walked out of me like that? Oh, Please go! Enemies of progress! I'm not eating. Hey! I'm just happy. I've never taken this thing since I was born. Hey! Conflex! Eh? Uh, even get hot drink. I won't even give you this one. I will hide it. Bag up. Hey! Keep one for my child. Oh, oh, give me, oh, give me, oh, give me. Hey! I'm so happy. I was trying to explain to you, you came and sat down. No, I don't like you. Though. Sister, it's not fair. What is not fair? Who do you even say gave this to you? If it is me, now you start talking. But I don't know this person. Why did you receive it? I don't know him. Uh, when you see him, you ask him down. Wait, though. He's like, you don't have respect. I'm talking and you're talking. Are you mad? And it's not a crime for me to have collected this for you. You were not around. I collected it on your behalf. Ugona is a big crime. Who asked you to collect it? Mbatek! I have delivered my message now. What, what, what is this? Mama, you Mama, you Mama, you Mama, Mama, you said you want to see my daughter. Why, if I may ask? I, I, I saw this beautiful daughter of yours, Olachi, and uh, she fits into the kind of woman I would love to marry. I met my cousin here, Chike, to inquire much about her. And Chike confirmed to me that she's one of the most decent women in this village that anyone would like to have as a wife. Chike, you did? Yes, Nai. You see, Olachi is a very decent girl. And my brother here has good intentions. Yes, Nai, I do have good intentions for your daughter. Uh, my being here is as regards my father's wish for me to marry a woman from this village. Seeing Olachi, I don't need the suits here to tell me that she's my missing rape. That's why I, I, I came directly to you to declare my intentions before I make it official. Well, I don't have much to say in an issue like this. Because the whole thing depends on the girl in question. But the best I can do for you is to allow you to move close to the girl, sort yourself out with her, and that is that. Thank you very much. I'm really grateful. Thank you. Thank you. Papa, it's impossible. It will not work. I cannot marry that man. I can't marry him. How do you mean you cannot marry him? Because I don't know him. You don't expect me to marry someone I barely know. Then how then do you know somebody without getting acquainted with the person? Papa, I don't like him. I don't want to get acquainted with him. Simple. You must be stupid by saying that. Now, Nkechi, okay, talk to your daughter. The best she can do for herself is to say yes to that young man. I think she needs time. Everything is happening so fast. It's not been long that she experienced heartbreak. And now this one is coming up. Please, I think I understand her point. Yes. She has no valid point. This is it. I said it. You are the one deceiving this girl. Mm. It is you. Can she the son of Iba That is rich, energetic, young, industrious. In fact, this boy has all it takes to be a man. You cannot compare him with that, that, that hooligan you dated. Now listen. Don't ever allow that boy to slip out of your hand. Because if you do, I will not forgive you. If you do, I will not forgive you in this house. In addition to that, Olaji, I suggest you give that man a chance. Shut up. Give him a chance, so 
he might be the right person for you the right man you have been longing to have i heard that he has money he has good money he will take good care of you if you ask me he's the right man for you please get it. Papa? You said you want so to leave me. Papa? Like a had a chance. Don't mind them. I'm Just relax. Like. Come down, come down. Where are you going? I was going to your house to return this to you. So you think you can buy my house with gifts and money? Okay? You cannot. That was why you went behind me to tell my father that you want to marry me without even letting me know. Because you think you have money. Oh, Kenneth, because you have heard about my story. That is why you want to take advantage of me. Okay? It will not work for you. Take this, I don't need it. I'm not trying to buy your love. Neither did I hear anything about you. I did this from my heart. Okay? Listen, I know you must have had terrible experiences in the past from men, but I am different. Okay, just give me a chance. I love you. I am not here to play you. <laughs> exactly what Mwara has been telling me. Mwara told me so many things, so... At the end, what happened? Ola, I am not Mwara or any other man you met in the past. I am different. Ola, listen, you are special. You deserve a good man. All I ask is for you to give me a chance, please. Okay? I will prove you wrong. Please. Okay, yeah, just come, let me drive you home, okay? Kimichi is a very good man. Besides, he's my kinsman. Look, I. I know how you feel right now. I understand that you are still in pain. I know what Mora did to you. I knew Mora was never the right person for you. And yet I allowed him to mess you up. And I hate myself for that. Listen to me, Ola. My brother Kenichi will take good care of you. He loves you so much. Please just open up your heart for him. You deserve to be happy. You deserve to smile again. I promise you, you are going to be the luckiest girl on earth if you just open up your heart for him. Please, just think about it, okay? Son, I wonder why you are suddenly back to the village. And not only that, you are behaving the way you are. I hope, is everything all right? All is all right, Papa. I know, by the look of things, I don't need to be told. So, where is your wife? Papa, don't even call that bitch my wife. This is a huge disappointment. I still cannot tell the reason she treated me the way she did. I just don't deserve it. Tell us everything. I, I don't know how to put it. But the truth is that when we got to the city, things changed. This is started acting funny. So that is it, Papa. This is threw me away like a trash. Like a trash? That's what you are. You deserve it. This is Nemesis. Look at what you did to an innocent girl, all right? Eh? Hey! Papa, don't even mess your own life. God has wiped her tears for what Mora did to her. Huh? Meaning? Olachi is married. Not only married, though, but married with a man with so much money. My brother, even where they wash his car, cannot be employed there. What? No. She's waiting for you. Mm -hmm. mm. I realized that I could not love any other woman like I loved Olaj. Oh. No need fooling myself, you know. 
after all this all these months I, I couldn't sleep I keep thinking about this woman so I decided to come back home and, and, and start again this is someone I love I don't have to deceive myself so that is it you know. how, how are you people have you finished yeah I'm, I've, I've finished Jigga is he talking to both of us was he saying something what? If not that you are not my friend, eh? if not that you are not my friend, I will tell you what. What? You mean you left that rich girl in the city only for you to return here and start access of all life? Of course, love, love has no boundaries. This is the woman I love. I can do anything for her. Don't you think, Chike? Mwana, now I can see that you're not just confused and dumb. You're also mad and stupid at the same time. No, Chike, you don't have to insult me. Ah, insult? Simora, if I have my way, I will beat the living hell out of you right now. Mm. Look at this fool. Anyway, what am I even beating you for? If I beat you now, you will die. Nature is already taking care of you. You will see it now. What do you mean by that? I still have money. I came back with a lot of, a lot of money. So I'm not alone, all right? If that's what you're thinking. Look at who's talking about money. Before I tell you one thing, let me just give you one sound. In case you've not heard, all Hashi is happily married. As a matter of fact, she now lives in the city with her rich husband. Do you even know who she's married to? She's married to my own kinsman, Kenechuku Ibanusi, the richest man in this entire village. That's a lie. Oh, that's a huge lie. It can never happen. I don't care if it's Dangote or anybody. No one has the right to give my wife to another man. It's impossible. Yes. Look at this fool. You're a madman, Nora. You're a foolish boy. Go to the other and insult me. Don't insult me. What is this? Yeah? Get out of my house. Get out of my house, you fool. Nora. Ever since you left the city for this village, there have been a lot of stories. You tell this person a different thing, you tell the other person a different thing. In all this, I know that this truth has not been said. That's why I come to you now, as your very good friend, for you to confide in me and tell me the truth, because I need to know. <laughs> I'm saying this because you need someone to confide in. And that should be me. So tell me the truth because I know you need help. And I'm here to offer that help. But I can't give you any help if you don't tell me what is going on. I have to understand the situation on ground so I know how to help you. Well, I don't think there's any point in hiding what happened because you've been like the one friend. I mean, and my secret has only been safe for you. The thing is, when I got to the city with Tessie, everything was moving on fine. We are loved up, we are living like husband and wife. But at, at the long run, I, I started noticing some funny attitude this was doing, especially with her phone. She was no longer free with her phones. If she's answering call and sights me coming, she will hang up. And I, I do see this particular guy that comes to the house all the time, which I even thought is the cousin or relation. 
but I was wrong. I came home one afternoon and behold, I saw this same guy kissing and smooshing Tacy on the couch. I couldn't believe my eyes. I tried confronting Tacy. Tacy, what's the meaning of this? Do you know what Tacy told me? Uh, uh, Mora, uh, I'm sorry to tell you uh, this, even though it might hurt you. What we had in the past is, is history uh, that she's no longer interested. I was shocked. Tacy, are you actually telling me this? You said yes. The guy tried to fight me. And all Tessie could tell me is that, Mora, please, I want you to leave my house. They threw me out of the house. Okay, you go. Tessie threw me out of the house. I was humiliated. The only thing on my mind now is Olashi. Okay, please. Olashi is the woman that I truly love. I know I've done mistakes in the past and I'm here to correct them. I want you to assist me. I need her back in my life. You're talking of impossibility. I can't help you. It is possible because we were in love. It's we not. can still come back together. It's, it's not. You see why I don't want to tell you? You keep asking me, say it, say it. Now, what are you going to do? Nothing. I thought we were talking about something feasible. Something we can do. Not an impossible task. We can do it. Getting back a married woman. The girl you ditched. Have you forgotten your story with this girl? I'm not going anywhere. Now, if you have anything to say, say it here. Not in my house. I said, I am here to see my Olashi. I paid her dowry, and she's still my wife. As tradition demands, she is still my wife. Please just bring her out. Let me go with my woman. What is wrong with you? Don't you have shame? Eh? Don't you have shame? We are talking of shame. The right question would have been, is he not scared? Is he not afraid? Walk into this compound and open his dirty mouth to ask a phone like Afraid? Afraid of what? Afraid to come and see my own wife, the woman I rightfully married. Nana is ah, I see. You still have the girl to stand here. Open your dirty mouth to sweep this nonsense. You. I see. All right, wait a minute. If you know what is good for you, leave this compound now before my husband comes back. If you inflict any injury on you, you use her to carry it. Leave this place now. Action. See about before he Action. comes back. Is that how you put want it? No, no problem. Come I'll come back. Come, come back. back. Come, come, back. Come, 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 back. come back. Come, come, come back. Come, 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 back. come. Where are you going? Come back. Come, come, back. Back. Woo come back. Come and carry your wife. Look at his waist. <laughs> Husband. Come! Idiots. Mazuk is here. Uh oh, uh, Izuna. Yeah. I am going to your place. I hope all is well. Maybe you didn't inform your son that I have duly returned the diary he paid on my daughter's head. Actually, I have not because I've been watching my son for some time, has not been talking anything about your daughter. So I decided to see whatever is happening. Well, he left my place a few minutes ago, threatening that he will bring down my building if I don't return all that to him. What? Is he mad? I should be asking you that question if he is mad. But even if your son is a madman, let him understand that my house is not a psychiatric center. Because any other day I see him there, I will end him up. I will kill him. He is your son. I'm very sorry. So I'm very call sorry. him to us. I'm very sorry for that. Sorry. I will talk to him. I wonder where this madness is coming from. Children of Dawa days. I will talk to him. I will take care of this matter. Please. You better do. I'm going back to my house. That's not possible. I never asked anyone to return the diary I paid on Olachi's head. Olachi is still my wife. Better go and return that diary to them and bring back my wife to avoid problems. Yes, boy. Are you insane? When did you start taking Indian hem? Papa, this is not a matter of smoking Indian hem. This is about my wife's hem or whatever. You're talking nonsense. 
I said you're talking rubbish. This is the day you publicly disgraced and denounced because one mommy what I showed up. Hey? Eh? That you're willing to concede that dowry as a compensation for whatever inconveniences that might have caused them. You did so. But let me tell you, stay away from Mazo Christian. Oh, Jikwale girl, for, for whatever he does to you, he will not be blamed. This is all what I have to tell you. I don't want to know anything he wants, let him do. I'm ready to do anything to get back my wife. I mean it to Papa. And Mama, you're not saying anything. Don't you have anything to say in this issue? I gave you my support. When you dish allergy for that rich girl, obviously I was a little behind you. Only for you to come back here some months later and tell them telling us that you want allergy back. <laughs> We've told you several times that allergy is married, though. She's married to another man, war. She's married. But why would they give my woman out to another man, knowing the fact that I paid her dowry? Mora. You are looking for trouble, and I hope you know that. Or they are the ones looking for my trouble. No, you are the one looking for their trouble. Well, I trust Mazo Kesio. He will deal with you. Look, you paid for all Archie's down, that I know. But you publicly divorced her. You even asked her family to take whatever you paid on her head. Now that Tessie has divorced and dumped you, you are back looking for the same girl you vomited. My friend said what you know. Who told you that this chased me out of the house? This is that adores me, that is ready to sacrifice her whole self for me. Oh, please, you can tell that to the birds. This dumped you and chased you out of her house. That is what I know. I don't know about Odeka. Ah. Oh, I did not though. <laughs> Who would believe such? It's obvious she got tired of him. <laughs> I used her left leg to kick him out of the house. <laughs> Oh, baby, that you guys are fools. Eh? fools. I don't even know why I, I, I befriend you people in the first place. Animals. I will blow you. See this I'll... guy. Eh? One day I will slap her. You will see him. I will blow you. You know, miss you, but make sure you return as promised, okay? I will. <laughs> you did me, daddy. <laughs> you know, my sunshine. Yes. Bye bye. Let him come. What are you 
What are you doing in this compound? I'm asking you. Come and listen to us. Your love, be serious. Who can tell you? I don't want my husband to come back here and meet you. Just get out. All I'm please remember what we said. Just leave. Why would I do that? 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 Make sure you don't come back to this house. Use less hopeless food. It's Possible though, he refused to go. I said, Open the gate. I should open the gate. Okay. What is it? Please let me explain. Please calm down. Calm down. Calm down. No problem. I will hear you out, but that will be a big issue. Eh? Eh. How do you mean? Eh, what I mean is that I have contacted them. That is where you explain to I and my husband what you have been coming to this house to do. No, it has, though. It has. Take a good look at your love. Take a good look at one and look at what they did to me. Just, just look at one. Let me tell you. You see this thing you're doing, it will not help you. Emotional blackmail? No, Allah. This is no emotional blackmail. I was beaten black and blue because I, I couldn't afford money to pay for my food. Allah. I know I have done that. I, I know you, you will not. Accept me, how? Uh, but 
Even though it's money for Tifa. Excuse me, let me just get out of here. Money for what? Tifa. Bros. Sheshi. Money again. I'm not going to give you 10 kobo. It's better you get out of this place. Oh. Just leave. Do you hear me? Else I'll call the police people to come and arrest you. You better run. You ain't got into that. So, Mike! Yes, Please close this gate for me. Nah, no, no, no. You're a madman. What kind of temptation is this now? Eh? I thought you were going to the village. What if something had happened to you? What would I tell the villagers? You just want to put problem on my head. What is all this now? Eh? Hey God. What would, I, what would I do now? What am I going to do now? Are you high? Is something wrong with you? He will die here. This is fever. This is fever. Mora, what is this thing now? What kind of problem is this? What kind of girl is this? Mike, no. No. What will I tell my husband if he comes back? You know what? We just have to go to the gate. Let me go and get drugs for him, okay? Be fast about it. Go. Have you taken your drugs? Yes. Hold on. I really appreciate it. 
she done the wrong for me. Could that bless her? Shh. I don't want to hear. Just have a little rest, little low, then you leave this house. Because I don't want my husband to come back and meet you here. No, no but I can't live like this. I'm almost naked. How is it my business? Eh? What ever happened to you out there? I think what happened to me or what happened between I and Tessie. Okay. Just forget it. No, Anna, let me tell you. You should be fast about it. Condition, please. Please don't call me all that again. If you want to call me, call it in full. Say all at you. Well, um, can I stay for a while till the fever subsides? Mm -hmm. Get it. You just have to leave, please. Come on. Just leave the house. Hello, honey, sweetheart. How are you? Yes, I'm fine. Yes, I'm all right. Of course, I'm at home. Okay, okay. <laughs> Take care. Know what I need from you. What do I do? What am I going to do now? Because I don't want him to see you. I don't want him to meet you here. Um, no, this is our guest room. But please, make sure you don't come out. Sure. No, I'm going to trouble okay. Just say, don't come out. Okay. I couldn't stand, I was missing my my sweet wife's nutritious cook. Yeah, I'm Really? Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait. Hello, Mr. Ramsey. Hi, how are you? You know, I always tell my friend this time, I'm working with that. I find it difficult to teach you now. My love, um, I'm going to have a good night with us soon. Let me get you to go. What is your problem? I thought you said you were sick. Yes, all along. Hunger chased me out of the bed. Eh, uh, and you couldn't just wait for me to finish eating with my husband. <laughs> to hate me, that you don't care if I die of hunger. Remember what we shared together. Please. Just shut up. Shut up your mouth. When I am done eating, I will come and serve you food. Make sure you don't leave this room. Else, you will not like what I will do to you. Not you, you went. 
tomorrow. Are you sure? Yes. If you don't like it, what have you to do to it? In this house, you yourself very never come to me. Ah! Any time I touch it, you feel as if you remember what promise of the other. Why don't you promise? So you promise to buy it for me? Yeah, I'll buy you one container. One container, of course. What is he doing here? What is it? It's your problem. Please go and explain to me. What if the person comes back and sees you? What will I say? What will I tell him? I came to apologize for all the wrong things that I've done to you. You've come to apologize. I am sorry. I don't think you need it. I need it. I need it more than every other thing in this world right now. My conscience has, has never stopped flogging me for all the wrong things that I did to you. How could I have foolishly lost the precious gift God gave to me? What is your problem? I know you're very stupid. You're a stupid person, yes, but it's late. I don't need all those things you're saying. Just go. It's never gone. We still have time to rectify things. We still have time to come back. Do you want to check me out? My love, you are married, yes. But you are not married to your heart. What nonsense are you talking about? Who said so? Are you in my heart? Please, just leave me, okay? I mean the whole thing that I'm telling you right now. I, I could not continue with Tessie because I, I couldn't find you in her. I left her. Mother, you mean you left Tessie for me? I swear down, when I left, happiness left me completely. My life became shattered. I thought I could still come back to you only to be told that you're married to another man. I almost died. Mama, what are you doing this to me? Just tell me, what is it? My love, I want you to come back. You don't have to lie to your heart. You love me and you know that. I am married. I am married for my own make. Married to your heart. You know your heart is not married to me. Look into your heart, right? I just want you to come back. Let's continue from where you stop. It's not what you think. 
I can explain everything to you. Seriously, you can do anything. Is this not Mora, your ex? Yes, I am Mora. No, what were you thinking? That she loves you truly when her true love is out there? Listen, Mr. Man, I have come to take possession of what is truly mine. And that you shall have. What? 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 My love, my love, my love, leave this man, leave this fool. What? What? what is he claiming? Let's go. We can survive without money. Come. I'm not a husband. Oh, yeah, yeah. You are the husband. You are the husband. Get out of my house. Hey, Mike, if I see this thing in my own house, I will come. How could you be so careless? Olachi, what is wrong with you? You know Mora is a, is, a, is, is a devil himself, yet you allowed him to come close to you. What is wrong with you? I was deceived. Mora blackmailed me. He, he has ruined my life. No. Mora did not ruin your life. You ruined your life by yourself. Because you are stupid and messed up. After all the things the boy did to you, you could not learn your lessons. Olachi, I am disappointed at you. Papa, I didn't know he had such evil plan. I didn't know. I'm just a stupid person. I'm so stupid. Of course you are so stupid indeed. I have no single blame for your husband. As a matter of fact, if you ask me, I will tell you, you are a wrong candidate for him. Hey, Papa. Nani, please don't talk like that. Do not talk like that. Don't shut up, woman. Keep quiet and don't provoke me anymore. Don't! Because you are the cause of all this. You are the cause of all this, woman. And you know it. Now, at the end of the day, after everything, look at where you landed her. Mm. Blame me for everything. I'm the cause of every wrong thing in this whole planet. Yes, I am. I was the one who even sent water to her house. It's okay. Mama is not okay. It's okay. I, I just feel like killing myself. Please don't do that. Please. Go. <laughs> oh, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? I'm asking you. Calm down, my love. Calm down. Eh? Isn't it obvious that I'm the only true love you have now? Look at the manner he, he threw your things out of the house. He couldn't even wait for you to explain things to him. My love, think about what I told you the last time. Let's eliminate this man and take possession of all his wealth. That's the only thing. You are a devil. You are just a devil from the pit of hell. If you know what is good for you now, just leave this compound. I said leave! Get out! Get out of this compound! Get out! Don't ever come back here again! What is it? Huh? What is the problem, Olachi? Olachi, what is it? Olachi, what is it? Now talk to us. Olachi. Listen. That boy ruined my girlfriend's life. He did not only steal her away from me, but threw her away like a trash. Exactly. I want him dead. I want him dead. I learned he will be visiting the village this weekend. 
Yes, this weekend. Come immediately so we can plan on how to eliminate him. Good, good, good. Thanks, man. You always got my back. Thanks. Okay. See you then. In the attempt to murder Kenichi. Are you serious? But why do you want to murder that innocent young man? Because he's stupid. He's very stupid. He believes Kenichi stole Olachi from him. Olachi? The Olachi he dumped and disgraced? That's why I said he's very stupid. If he is a bit reasonable, what he should have done is to go on his knees, beg Kenichi for forgiveness. Yes. Because he wronged that guy. He tore his family apart. I mean, Kenichi and Olachi were living happily. They were happily married. God himself involved and tore the family apart. Now the only thing you could think was to attack him, trying to kill him. But my happiness is that he failed and he will continue to fail. Now he's going to remain behind bars. He's going to rot in jail for ages. That means our God in heaven have intervened for Kenichi. Of course. Was it not for the divine intervention of God, they would have succeeded. He's going to rot in jail for ages. I'm not wrong, I'm not wrong. 